CompTIA A plus Core 1, 220-1101, Practice Exam. Questions 141 through 145. This video is part of our Practice Exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 141. For migrating virtual machines from an on-premises environment to the cloud, an administrator would typically utilize which service model? The answer is A, IS. Infrastructure as a Service or IS provides virtualized computing resources over the internet. In the context of cloud migration, IaaS allows organizations to outsource their needs for physical computing hardware, networking components, servers, and storage while still providing full control over their software environment. This means administrators can easily migrate their existing virtual machines to the cloud where the IaaS provider handles the physical infrastructure. Question 142. A technician needs to replace a ribbon in a printer due to poor quality text and image output. What kind of printer is likely being serviced? The answer is A. Impact. Impact printers, also known as dot matrix printers, use a print head that physically impacts the paper through a ribbon to produce text and images. The ribbon, Coated with ink can become faded with use, leading to poor print quality. Replacing the ribbon is a common solution to restore the printer's ability to produce a clear and sharp output. Question 143. To enhance a server's resilience against multiple drive failures through a RAID setup, which RAID level would an administrator likely choose, given the need for redundancy in performance? The answer is D, RAID 10. RAID 10, also known as RAID 1 plus 0, combines the mirroring of RAID 1 with the striping of RAID 0. This configuration offers both redundancy and performance, as data is mirrored across pairs of drives, providing fault tolerance. In the event of a drive failure, the system can continue to operate using the mirrored copy while the failed drive is replaced and rebuilt. RAID 10 requires at least four drives, but can withstand multiple drive failures as long as the failed drives are not within the same mirrored pair. Question 144. A user needs to provide internet access from their smartphone to a laptop due to an unexpected DSL outage. What action should be taken on the smartphone to share its cellular connection with the laptop? The answer is B. Configure the smartphone to act as a hotspot. Enabling the smartphone's hotspot feature allows it to share its cellular data connection with other devices via Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, or USB. This turns the smartphone into a wireless access point, providing internet access to the laptop when traditional wired connections fail. It's a quick and practical solution to ensure uninterrupted internet connectivity during outages. Question 145. A user wants to upgrade to the quickest hard drive possible. Out of the many drive connections available on the user's laptop, which one should the technician suggest as the optimal choice? The answer is A. NVMe drive. The NVMe drive is the best choice for speed in a hard drive upgrade because it uses the PCIe interface, which offers significantly higher data transfer rates compared to other drive connection options. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did. It's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button.
This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.